it's Morgan Meredith with Living a Blissful Life on Healthy Place and today I'm going to talk about being early and what that can provide for your life. Um, so I used to be someone who was late, uh, you know, five minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. Sorry, there was a there was traffic or, you know, my dog or, you know, whatever else. And rushing in apologizing when you're first getting somewhere creates a an environment that it's difficult to sort of settle into. It takes you a few minutes to really become present. So it's there's like there has to be like a, a period of calming and it's much easier if that just isn't isn't part of your experience. If you're already there, you're on time, you're happy, you can welcome in the other person. Um, and the way that I started doing that was planning to be half an hour early. Um, so if I planned to be half an hour early and I ended up 15 minutes late, I was still early. Um, or, you know, that snag in traffic that always happens or the issue with the car that happens or whatever still makes it so that I'm either early or on time. And of course, I'm not perfect. I, I sometimes am still a little bit late. But what it really provided for me is this experience in traffic that was really different. So I noticed people, and I wasn't one of these people, people were just getting so angry with each other. Like, oh, that person cut me off and this person's going so slow. I can't believe they're so they're so dumb and going so slow. People are, you know, screaming at each other in the car. You can see them, you know, their veins are popping out. They're giving each other, you know, all kinds of nasty hand gestures, all that stuff. And the reason is because they're stressed that they're going to be late based on this other person's behavior. And what I realized is if I'm early, it doesn't matter as much if somebody just cuts me off or, you know, gets in front of me in that exit. Like, I'm still going to make it and they're the stressed out one. Um, the other thing that I really started noticing when it comes to traffic is there's still, your body is still gonna respond to near accident experiences or accident experiences. You get that fight or flight, the adrenaline is rushing and all that stuff. Um, so all of that is still gonna happen, but there's less of that happening just in the middle of traffic. Uh, if, if you're early. So consider planning to be half an hour early. And again, it's never going to be perfect. There's always something that can come up. But um, I really believe that there is no such thing as a person who can't be on time. So I've heard people say, you know, I'm just a late person. Well, consider that you're not a late person and just change that one thing and see how it affects all the other areas of your life.